can we prove that sine over sine plus cos is the same as tan over one plus tan? Well, I don't like having tan thetas floating around too much inside trig identities. So I'm gonna start with the right hand side and I'm gonna have tan over one plus tan. But like I said, I don't like tan. I like replacing it with the quotient identity. Tan is sine over cos. So I'm going to replace it on top. I'm gonna to replace it on bottom. There we go. Now we have something divided by something else, but I can't do the whole division by a fraction is multiplication by its reciprocal unless I have a single fraction in the denominator. So how do I get one fraction in the denominator? I'm gonna need a common denominator. So my top is still sine over cos, check. Now I'm going to have to add to sine theta over cos theta, but I need to replace this one with something over cos theta. I'm choosing cos theta for the bottom because that's the common denominator I want. One happens to be anything over itself, so I'm gonna choose cos theta over cos theta. Now I'm still dealing only with the bottom. I have sine theta over cos theta on the top of my mega fraction. And on bottom, I have something over cos plus something over cos. Common denominator, check. Top plus top gives me cos theta plus sine theta. Those are together all over the common denominator of cos theta. Now this is something over cos divided by something else over cos. The cos is technically cancel here, if you're confident in that. But I'm gonna show you that division by a whole fraction like that is the same as multiplying by its reciprocal. Here's my sine over cos from the numerator of this big fraction. Dividing becomes multiplication as long as this flips. So it becomes cos over cos theta plus sine theta. Now it's probably more obvious that the over cos times cos here will cancel with each other and leave us with sine theta on top and on bottom we have cos plus sine. Now the order you add things in doesn't matter, just like five plus four is the same as four plus five. So I can take the liberty to turn that into sine theta plus cos theta, just to emphasize to everyone that it's the exact same as what I started with on my left side. Oh yes, let us celebrate with a therefore, left side equals right side, therefore the sine of an angle divided by sine plus cos of that angle is the same as tan divided by one plus tan for that angle. Beauty. All it took was quite a few substitutions and some finesse with fractions. You can do it. I believe in you. Best of luck.